Okay, Abe and Sherry, this video is about your furnace. Your furnace is a forced air propane fuel furnace made by Duquesne. Uh, the company I bought this from is called R.E. Michael, and they're in Syracuse. Let's see if this will focus or not. I don't know. There we go. Yeah. Uh, R.E. Michael, they're on East Washington Street. There's their phone number. And, you know, that would be in the event that, you know, the local people, uh, BJ Queens, could not find the part that you want. Uh, I get a number for BJ Queens. You really should put this in your contacts because these guys are in Eagle Bay. They are the only game in town for furnace repairs. Uh, you know, if you had a problem with your well or your pump or whatever, they can pretty much do it all. And they're they're really the only game in town, so you want to put these guys in your contacts. So, but anyways, a little bit more about the furnace. It's a you know 90% efficient furnace, and if you look, you can see a drain line that's to get rid of all that condensate, and that goes over to your. Uh, your sump pump set up in that pan I set up. So, anyways, if it needs to be worked on, it has a separate power shutoff up here. And it also has a separate gas shutoff over here. So, I also bought a brand new igniter that's never been used that's one of your parts that usually goes first i've never had anything wrong with this furnace but if bj queen comes and says you need a new igniter you can tell them hey uh, i hope you use the one that was down there already so you don't have to charge me for the part and over here on this board there's a little wire tie and everything you want to know about the furnace is in there so i'll put it back under there you know on top of that board with a wire tie around it but uh that's pretty much it you know you just want to be careful never stick anything you know too close to your furnace so uh, i put a little bumper guard on here so you don't accidentally move something around and bust off your little p-trap for your drain but that's pretty much it and the only other thing you're going to need to know is uh, changing the filter and these filters I believe are a 16 by 25 uh, if you have allergies you should probably get the 3m filters which are three or four times more but they're a better filter and to change the filter just move this little dowel here to the side open this up and you can see your filters in there just if you can't grab it and pull it out, just stick it with a screwdriver and pull it out. When you're done, you know, make sure you put it in with the arrow that says airflow. Well, you can see there's an airflow arrow there. Make sure the airflow arrow is pointing in the same direction as this arrow. And once you get the new one in there, just close it up and turn your dowel. And that makes for a nice airtight seal. And you don't get dust from the um, crawl space going through your through your furnace. So, but that's pretty much it on the furnace. And remember, BJ Queen is the company that's going to get you out of trouble if you need to call someone.